This is Drew with thepodcastingstore.com, your one-stop shop for all things podcasting and remote learning. Well, greetings and welcome to another one of our videos. Last week I was under the weather and wasn't able to do all the content creation that I wanted to in the way that I wanted to. I want to put out something useful every single day that has some value to the people that take the time to you know, consume my stuff, you know, read my essays, watch my videos and things like that. Well, I couldn't talk. So on Friday, I shared a video from uh, marketing and branding expert Jason Stapleton on creating better thumbnails for YouTube. For my weekend update video, I wanted to take a clip from that video and share it. The problem with that was, uh, well, I'll show you what the problem is on that. So here, we'll come over on the screen share. And you can see, so I've got the YouTube video and here's an excerpt you know, from tutorial, it. tutorial, but pretty much any photo editing software will work. So just use whatever you've got. So he's talking about photo editing software, fantastic. Um, if I click over here on download, so I could download the clip and use it, I run into the, the YouTube um, premium wall. I don't want to subscribe to YouTube premium and I've tried the free trial. It doesn't do exactly what I need it to do for this kind of purpose. So I skip the free trial, but I still really want to download the video. So what do I do? Well, first I'm going to preface with don't steal other people's stuff. Full stop. This is a video that I know Jason wants out there. He's a buddy of mine and he's trying to help as many people as possible and he wants to get this out there so that people can use the information. If I didn't already know that, I would have asked his permission before trying to share his video because I wanna make sure he's okay with it. It's his stuff, it's not mine. Don't steal other people's stuff. Copyright exists for a reason and it allows creators to benefit from their work and thereby want to create more stuff. With that out of the way, how can we take a video that can't be downloaded and download it? Well. We're going to use a free piece of software called VLC. VLC is a video uh, a player, a media player actually, that can play any format of anything. Extremely, extremely useful. I use it for everything. It has a really cool feature within it though that's going to come in handy here. So we'll go back to the screen share. So what we're going to do is copy the video address. And then we'll come over to VLC, open that up, and we go into media, and then open network stream and the video should come up. Now I'll preface with, if you, you know, while we're waiting for that to load up, uh, if you don't have VLC and you wanna get it, follow that QR code right there. That'll take you right to where to download it. Like I said, it's free, open source, great piece of software. So we come back over to the screen share on, well, this is up, on VLC. Today We'll pause Jason there. So we've got the video loaded in here now into VLC. Well, we're gonna come over here to tools and codec information. Come down here to location, this really big complicated uh, jumble of information, and we're gonna copy that. Then we come back over to our web browser, I'm gonna open a new window, and we're gonna paste that. And then you well, see what's, what's up happen. everybody? Today, we're talking thumbnails. And in this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how- So there's our video again, but this address looks a little bit different. Well, it has a really cool property now to it where you can download it. So rather than bore you while we're waiting for that to download, it is now downloading to my computer. So by using VLC, opening up your network stream, copying your address from YouTube into it, and then opening and copying your codec information, going back into your web browser, uh, entering that in there, and then clicking on the three buttons, you can download the video. I know that sounds complicated. I thought it was the first time I did it. Super simple, very intuitive. But once again, do not steal other people's stuff. It, when in doubt, ask first. We're going to come up with an essay talking on that very topic here soon. Hope you found this useful. Comment below, let me know what you think and other stuff that you want to see. Like, share, subscribe, check out the other videos in the channel, and we'll catch up with you next time. If you're facing a unique problem with podcasting or remote learning, we can help. Reach out to us at thepodcastingstore.com and we'll see what solutions we can find for you. And if you like what you hear, do me a favor and tell a friend. Follow us on Facebook, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and sign up for our e-newsletter and you'll never miss another podcast or video again. This is Drew with thepodcastingstore.com. Thank you for listening.